One of the best things to do in Buenos Aires is to take a day trip on the ferry over to Uruguay to the charming colonial village of Colonia del Sacramento, founded in 1680 by the Portuguese. So this morning we have boarded the Colonial Express ferry over to Uruguay from Buenos Aires. We got our tickets online ahead of time and it was cheaper for us to go with Get Your Guide because we actually get a guide with the tickets. The boat left about 8.30 this morning. The ferry takes about an hour and a half each way. We recommend you being there an hour to an hour and a half early because of the long lines. There's Argentina over there, Buenos Aires. And we arrived. Welcome to Colonia de Sacramento, Uruguay. Colonia de Sacramento is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It was originally a Portuguese fort and port. This is the Basilica of the Holy Sacrament. It's one of the oldest churches in Uruguay. This used to be the governor's house. All that's left is a foundation. Lunch in Uruguay. Got a chicken sandwich here. <laughs> Here we are at the remains of the fort. Look how thick the walls were. And um, apparently they don't have this rock here. They had to get it shipped in when they built the fort. We have a original cannon from the fort here. There's the ocean. There's some really cool beaches around here, too. It's the Wall of the Fort. San Miguel. So this is the famous Street of Size right here. It's the only original street left here in Colonia de Sacramento. And the reason that it is named Street of Size is because this is a very poor part of town and it's also way back in the day where the prostitutes lived. And so men would walk by here and they would see all the women and they would sigh. It is the only original cobblestone road left here in the city. These, this area is totally original, these houses. So this, uh, this last house right here, actually, you know, somewhat recently sold for a million dollars. And this was the very poor side of town originally. Okay, so we have the lighthouse here, the Colonial Lighthouse. And right in front of it, that's attached to it, used to be a convent. And the convent was built in 1694, and it was destroyed by a fire in 1704. They started the construction of the lighthouse in 1845, and it was finally finished in 1857. 
You used to be able to climb to the top of the lighthouse, but someone decided to end their life from the top and they don't allow anyone to climb it anymore. So it remains closed. Hola. Hola. Those are cool. Over here behind me used to be an engine storage house for um, steam locomotives. You'd have a slot for each steam engine, and they were brought into there by the turntable over here. Very cool. <laughs> Behind me is a water tower that was used to support the steam locomotives. I hope you enjoyed our one day in Colonia, Uruguay. And uh, thanks for watching and we hope to see you in the next one. You're on. This here is the uh, this here is a water tower for the, the steam locomotives, right? It's an M&M &M dispenser for... <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you'd like to see more.